it's Robin, Robin's Rome Readings. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. This is going to cover March's energy, but it's going to be more than that because we're going to do an extended, uh, you can purchase the extended for $4 if you'd like. There'll be a link below the video. I started your reading. I got all the way to almost to the end of it, and then this massive alarm went off. So please forgive me for this. Um, it's all laid out, and I'm not changing it thing for my beautifuls, but I will bless you with sacred anointing. This is a blessed reading. So thank you, Spirit, protecting my energy, protecting yours, calling in white light and love, guides, healing, bringing in healing energy that stabilizes my Leos. You deserve love. You deserve to be, have the kind of, um, this kind of a reading. I'm going to revamp it for you, okay? So, what I got when I pulled the love cards was, this is what they told me. You have new love, and you're either you've met someone already, or you're getting ready to, and it's a new love. And guess what, people? It's a soulmate, right? This is someone that's going to be on the same level. They're going to be the one that you want. At this time, the fairies are saying, whatever you're wishing for, Wish wisely, because use your wishes wisely to manifest. Whoops, Robin. Look at the color, too. Isn't that pretty? It's really purple. I don't know how I, well you guys can see in this light. Take practical steps towards making your dreams come true. So practicality, right? Practicality doesn't let you, um, it's going to keep you from making the same old, same old, same old mistakes. You're making, you're moving forward, and you need trust. The situation, the guides are saying, this is going to be a matter of trust for you, okay? And I asked about that, and they, and they, Lenormand, and they said, yes, this is a soulmate. You're leaving somebody that, uh, someone's here for you, a new start. It's going to be resetting a new cycle for you, and uh, ending an old one that didn't help you any. Someone's longing for you really, really bad, and, and they want you so bad. They want you so bad. They want to build with you. They want you to help them build a future and have something to help the world with, and they're, they're willing to do whatever it takes, whoever this is. And this is what I got, babes. Wow. I got the Nine of Cups right away. I said, who is this energy coming towards my Leos or in their space? Wish fulfillment. You are their wish fulfillment. Huh. In order to get to you, they have to leave something else, so they got to walk away. I asked, what are they walking? See, they're coming towards you. You're the light for them. You're absolutely the light for them. They can see your light. They felt it. They got the spark, okay? They felt the spark in your presence. They know you're a soulmate. They know, okay? Cancer Scorpio Pisces person. A new one, okay? This could be Gemini. They love you. They have, whoever this is, they might also be leaving somebody they didn't, that didn't, um, another person in their life, perhaps. You know, it's a requirement. In order to commit to you, because this person um, didn't make them happy, they came your direction for wish fulfillment, okay? So they're coming your direction for wish fulfillment. Lovers is a choice. I think they're choosing you. Take a look. They're choosing you. Wow. Just wow. I got chills. I got chills. I love it. Thank you, Spirit, that you love them so much. So I started your Celtic cross. And in your extended, we're going to take a look at who these people are, what, they, what, they, what you can expect to happen, what are the intentions, and what do you need to do to get there? I asked what your energy was. I got the two of cups in reverse. Somebody from the past. Could be a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. You're like, nope. Bad news bears. Nope. I'm leaving. Six of swords. I'm leaving for peace of mind. You might have a Gemini also, by the way. Um, I feel the vibration of somebody who loves who's being loved on incredibly by a Gemini. Um, and this may not be everybody's story, okay? Welcome in, by the way. Um, I did your reading already, so I'm sorry I got a little 
disheveled because the alarm went off and it was insane. Oh, God. Anyhow, back to this. Leo, I wish this for you. Every one of you. No more pain. No more looking back. No more putting up defenses. No more trying to fix people. Trying to improve your point. Arguing. No more. You're not going to take it anymore. Why? Your future is phenomenal. What was crossing you is the, yeah, what's in your higher mind, of course, is the strength card yourself. You're like, I'm just going to be me. I'm going to be powerful. I'm going to move forward because I'm the bomb.com. I have been feeling less than the bomb.com, but I know that love is here. I know that I need to be strong because this looks damn nice, okay? What, uh, what was crossing you is a magician. This could be Pisces, Virgo, Gemini. Somebody that knows how to build. Somebody that really wants to build with you and knows how to, how to make, make things actually happen. Really, really make them happen. I see someone wanting to make this happen and they're going to leave somebody else to prove their point. And they're going to be done. This is Virgo, I see, possibly. Or Gemini, Pisces. They're, gonna, they're coming for you, is what I see. We're going to find out what their intentions are, if you can expect them to act quickly in this relationship. But this is what's crossing you, is the massive, a good communicator, someone who knows how to um, pop you into a whole new resonance, a whole new life, right? You've already dealt with the bitch. Male, female, it doesn't matter. It's a character assessment. This person likes to fight. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy is spiritual, mental, and they always jabbing at you, always making you feel like you're not worthy of them or always putting you down. You're like, no, I don't think so. F, nine of wands, you put it down. You figured out they had dev de de devilish bondage. They were keeping you in bondage. You're like, mm, -mm. So you cast a judgment on that situation. You said, not no. But hell no, you ain't getting none of me. I'm going to change and transform, and I'm going to find this. And here it is, my beautifuls. And recently, you've been very, very protective of your energy. You've been very protective of what you found, and you have every right to be strong. Every right to be strong. This is passion. This is your own stuff. You're being blessed. And I see Lyra, and I keep hearing, you see, this looks like a... A harp. So angels have been helping you. I don't know if you know this or not, but I'm telling you what I get. And if future forward, we have the Queen of Pentacles. This is a commitment. This is spouse energy. This is, I'm going to really put everything I have into this relationship. I'm going to trust. I'm going to wish wisely and I'm going to trust Taurus Virgo Capricorn energy. Now remember, it doesn't have to be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. They have to have the qualities of being able to pull you out of the past and just, bam, put you right into the present so you enjoy your life. She's not a fast-moving energy. But by God, she's grounded, secure, intelligent. This energy is grounded, secure, intelligent, committed, and secure. Good with money, good with people. Oh, my God, you deserve it. All right? So you are being seen. Let's go from this point on. Those alarms, if they go off again, I'm going to have a nervous fit. All right, beautifuls. It's just unbelievable. Here we go. You're being seen as somebody who's a little bit on the unhappy side at this moment. People don't know, though. Ace of Cups in reverse. They see you alone, maybe at this moment. Clarify that. King of Swords in reverse. My darlings, that could be this right here. Some of you haven't broken away yet, but I guarantee you, if you have the strength to break away, you got something amazing in the universe coming your way. And by God, you deserve it because you're absolutely beautiful, powerful. For God's sake, you're represented by strength and the sun. Pure, unadulterated, fascinating healing. For that, mwah, 
okay? The King of Swords is uh, also not a very nice person. And it seems like you, some of you may still be um, trying to get over something in your mind, right? It, it affected you. Clarify. See, there you are. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Leo, 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 Leo. The sun's going to heal you. I see this is God energy. This is God energy for you. All right? This is going to become a thing of the past, but you're being seen that way. Some people see you as their shining light. Whoever this is, they see you. You're right here in all your glory. Look, there you are. How can you deny this absolute fabulosity? You can't. You can't. So what's the environment that my, my beautiful Leos are in right at the moment? So people see you as sad. They see you as having put up with a lot of shit. They see you having to fight for yourself all the time, seven of wands. They see that. What they don't see is what's coming, and it's absolutely fabulous. You will find out more in the extended. We're going to look into this character of these people and what they want to say to you, what they intend to do. Um, Gives you some advice, too. Your environment is showing up as the lovers twice, twice. This is Shazam. That's, I may have to call this that. This is your, this is your environment. So you have a lover. You might have two. One you got to get rid of. Maybe it's you leaving for your wish fulfillment. Maybe it's you because this Ace of Cups is upright and this one is in reverse. All right. Oh, Leo, I love you so Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I love this. Gemini, the lovers. Tell me about your big concern, though. Your concern is that some of you, uh, you wonder if love is real. Okay. Is love real? Really? Is it real? Am I dreaming? That's what I hear. Am I dreaming this? Is it possible that there are more options for me? Yes. Yes, it is. This is a gigantic universe, and you're here for a reason, and you deserve to spend your rest of your time in love, not fighting with the wrong energy. It takes strength to get away from that. But you have some motivation here. A lover. Six of wands. Your victory. Oh, my God, you guys. You're getting the victory on this. Look at There's your own. Look at Leo. You're all over your own reading. This is the most fantastic Leo reading I think I've ever done. And I'm freaking out with joy because I love it, love it, love it. Oh, my goodness gracious. That's beautiful. So let me get a card from the Wisdom of the Oracle by Colette Baron reed for you beautifuls. And by the way, I'm so sorry. I, I keep trying to upload everything on the first. And you know what? I just can't keep up with everybody, so I'm going to bring them when I bring them. If you're loyal, if you like this reading, by all means, like it. <laughs> right? Like it. Oh, look. Exchanging gifts. This is nine, two, and seven. You're making a deal with God. That's what I get. The pink energy is your heart. The kitty cat is a spiritual being here to guard your beautiful movements. Let's see what the card says, though, because there's guidance here. The extended is going to give you so much more, though. Like I said, it's uh, if you're not a Patreon member, Patreon members will be able to get theirs for free. All you have to do is ask me. Boom. Boom. So check out my Patreon link, too, guys, okay? All right. Let's see. What is this message for my beautiful... see 20 I'm sorry my teeth are weird I, <laughs> all right here's your message Leo the law of giving and receiving reciprocity six of swords six of wands victory of course it is so you're entering into a productive and enriching time when all manner of opportunities are being offered to you you have everything you need to seize them, yet in order to honor them, 
you must put in the time. Exchange your experience and skills and commit heart and soul to what you're choosing to pursue. You can do it. You have what it takes to be successful if you align with the law of giving and receiving. You must engage in a dance of give and take, push and pull, doing and being. And if you let fear guide your choices, you could deplete yourself or create an imbalance. This is not a time of just do, do, do. Use your currency wisely and be mindful of the values others bring into your life. And you got wish wisely. Interesting. Now let's see what uh, this, this says about relationships. Love is an exchange of a life force energy between two beings, and it grows exponentially. Thank you. You can see this card with the lighting here. It grows ex exponentially when it's reciprocated. That means they love you back, and they show it to you. The magician is definitely going to show it to you. There's some changes going on. I love it. You must give and receive in order for love to flourish and abundance to flow between you. And Spirit wants you to start accepting all the blessings waiting for you, as well as offer the same gift in return. Open your heart. Allow it to be filled. Let love in and let it flow out of you too. Love is truly yours today. Isn't that beautiful? Whoa, Nine of Cups, Ace of Cups, Magician, Lovers Twice, Soulmate, Trust, and New Love. I don't know. I don't know if I've ever done a better reading for you in all of these years. This is wonderful. Well, this is where I'm going to leave it, guys. If you'd like to have the extended and find out clarification on this, these people, you'll know more in the extended what you should do if you have questions. Thank you for being here. And by all means, show me some love. Energy exchange. Thank you for hitting the like bell. I am receiving gifts if you'd like to donate to the channel. I thank you for that. You'll keep my channel alive and well. I thank you so much for your presence. Join me on Patreon. You get your readings for, you get your extended readings free, and you get your basic readings, any kind of reading you want, for 22-22 only. You have to be a Patreon member to get it, though. So come and join me. I love you, love you, love you. Namaste, my beautiful Leos. Take good care. Bye.